lawsuit was about her having a negative effect on my children. That's what that lawsuit was about. And when her behavior and the things she did and said began to affect my sons, that's when I opened my mouth. Do you feel broken about what's going on today? I feel broken, I feel hurt, mm -hmm. and again, I had to go to God. Mm -hmm. I always resort to go back to God mm -hmm. because I had to ask God why. Mm -hmm. The things that the abuse that has happened to my grandchildren, the things that has happened. Now they all know how I've been dishing out all the juicy updates on Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade's marriage. Right well race yourselves because I've got some mind-blowing news that's gonna leave you shook Dwayne Wade's ex-wife and the mom of his first two kids CO Bayon Funes has just joined them. Group chat and is spilling tea on him and Gabrielle. And trust me, it's absolutely crazy now CO Pan came prepared with some solid evidence to support her claim that Gabrielle influenced her daughter Zia. To transition into a transom offer some profit, and she didn't hold back folks CO Bond straight up exposed Gabrielle for playing mind games with Zia and keeping her away from her real mom. There's a whole lot of drama unfolding in your bet. I'll be sharing every jaw-dropping bit of it, y'all. Zion born um, as a boy came home and said, hey, uh, so I want to talk to you guys. Um, you know, I think going forward, I'm ready to live my truth. And I want to be uh, referenced as she and her. Uh, I would love for you guys to call me Zaya. Okay, so I swear there have been so many updates on this whole Gabrielle Union versus Dwayne Wade drama. And it's easy to lose track of all these updates in case I'll miss the tea gossip blog D. Moy recently revealed that Dwayne and Gabriel are on the out after yet another cheating scandal joy. Wrote Dwayne is very close to a woman not Gabrielle. He was spotted getting very close to her spoke to her very intimately while I was there for two hours. Gabrielle also has some interesting posts on her Instagram. When clarity, youth, and transparency are present, there's only room for evolution. Gabrielle just posted on her Snapchat a picture of their daughter. I'd do anything for her peace. They also said somebody else messaging me that Dwayne keeps posing with the kids and not with Gabrielle Gabrielle hat. Only been posting with their daughter and not their other kid and insider said they will be like Will and Jada if they ever separate, they will keep it quiet and live their separate lives but keep on a you. Knighted front for years if necessary. Well this just burst the whole drama wide open and insiders started to report that Dwayne is on the DL and that Gabrielle has been his beard. I mean this shouldn't be so surprising because Jaguar R spilled the tea last year. They ain't doing as much, I guess, now because they're getting older. I guess it just moved over to the Wade house. Energy transfers, energy and transfers. And I'm not saying that because I'm not saying that because of their trans daughter. I'm saying that because of the artist that I just spoke to not that long ago that got invited to a party at their house. Everything was cool up front till they went to the back and it was a bunch of old and young boys back there, all ass naked in the wave house. Okay, so now that y'all are now up to speed on the latest happenings, let's dive into the rather M the allegations that Dwayne Wave's ex-wife, Siopan F.E.S., is throwing out there, especially about Gabrielle now ever since we got wind of Dwayne and Gabrielle split. There's been a whole lot of talk about what's in store for Z. Now that Gabrielle won't be a constant presence in her life, you see Zia and Gabrielle have always had a super tight bond and people have been quite worried about how she's going to cope with this whole situation, especially considering she's undergoing a very public transformation with millions of people scrutinizing her every move, so naturally there have been lots of thoughts on the matter. But according to Sia of Han, the reason Zia is in this situation to begin with is because Gabrielle allegedly pushed her to change her identity now what now. According to CEO Bond, Gabrielle wanted the attention that came with having a child in the LGP plus spectrum, but didn't want to subject her own daughter to that spotlight, so she allegedly turned to Zia. And since Kavia is still pretty young and does doesn't quite understand all this stuff about gender identity, Sia Pong claims that Gabrielle begins subtly manipulating Z, planting little seeds of doubt in her mind, until she believed that. She genuinely wanted to identify as a trans woman, okay? Let's not be insensitive here, but I got to let y'all know what C.O. Ban is saying about the whole situation. But according to Dwayne Z, has always known. When deep down that she was meant to be a girl, and she bravely opened up about it when she felt like it was the right time. My wife looked at each other, 
right? And and the reason we looked at each other is because of this, you know, as kids, I used to put on heels. I used to put on, I used to do all those things. I try, I try to put on whatever my sisters wear, when all my sisters did, I try to do those. Now let's talk about Siobhan's view of the situation. She firmly believes that Dwayne and Gabrielle are lying through their teeth to hide the real story according to her. They're pushing Z into something she might not genuinely want all in the name of getting attention, and fame now Siobhan even went. As far as to suggest that D. Wayne might be living vicariously through Z or fulfilling some personal fantasy, let's not forget these rumors about Dwayne in last recent weeks. I mean, he openly admitted to cross-dressing in the past. So, who was Dwayne secretly wanting to be a trans woman all along? In addition to being on the DL, is this why he's pushing Zia to be what she biologically isn't? Now, if this is true, you all want to know what the truly messed up a part about all this is Siobhan dropped some major bombshells about how Gabrielle and Dwayne isolated her from Z throughout this whole ordeal. She claimed that Gabrielle was so obsessed with playing the role of Z's mom that she not only cut Dwayne off from co-parenting with Siobhan, but also went to great lengths to prevent Siobhan from even seeing Z. But Siobhan had even more teach to spill because let her tell it she revealed that night. Not only did Gabrielle cheat with Dwayne while she was married to him, but she also put in considerable effort to isolate Siobhan from her own children. In the process, Gabrielle portrayed herself as the perfect stepmother and painted Siobhan as the crazy, jealous, and toxic ex wife who was also a bad mother. So while Zia was going through the process of coming out to her friends and family, she was essentially cut off from her real mom, Siobhan. Now y'all remember that messy confrontation that took place last year? or earlier this year, when Dwayne publicly announced that he was in the process of changing Z's name and gender on all official documents while C.O. Bon strongly opposed this move. But Gabriel and Dwayne spun it to make her seem transphobic, hinting that she couldn't accept Z embracing her true self as a girl. Now it's worthy to note that Dwayne isn't typically the type to air out his private issues in public. So the fact that he quickly went public with this drama seems to us that it was just C-A-E-P-R move, unless Siobhan tell it that's exactly what it was in Dwayne's statement, he said. Since this must be the new way of parenting, I guess I have to address these allegations here. Which is a shame I've received a social media post about me forcing our 15-year-old child to be someone. She's not and to do something against her will. These are serious and harmful allegations that have hurt our children. Not one in our house would ever force Zia or any of our children to do anything against their will much less force an identity on them. This isn't a game for my family and definitely not for Z. I will not sit on my hands this time and allow her to make a mockery of my dedication to my family. And let me break all that down for you. Sigh of hand wasn't exactly against Zia, embracing her true self. As a trans person, she was all for Z's journey, but her point was straightforward. Let Z make the significant life decisions when she's old enough to understand and choose for herself without Gabrielle and D. Dwayne manipulation, so apparently Siobhan doesn't have an issue with Z sexuality or gender identity, but she just wanted the legal aspects to wait until Zia reached the age of 18. I mean, she couldn't legally sign for things without parental consent anyway. So what's the rush, but there's more. To this story, because Siobhan had another issue with the way Gabrielle was handling it, she felt it was all about Gabrielle's obsession with publicity going through a gender transition is a very personal and a been challenging even even for adults, and it becomes even more difficult when it's happening in the public eye. Siopan understood this, which is why she wanted Zia to go through this process more privately. However, according to Siopan Gabrielle and Dwayne had different intentions.